Bubba, how how frustrating is it when you guys have a a, a blocking penalty on a, a big return called back? Yeah, that's one thing we've stressed all season is playing clean in the return game. I think we're one of the fewest penalized teams in the league to this point. You know, it was unfortunate we had the one uh, we had the one hold on the kick return and we had the ball to the 30. So we ended up starting, I think, at the 15 there. Thankfully, our offense was able to move the ball and we ended up scoring on that possession. And then we had, you know, just a dumb penalty on the uh, punt return to look at midfield, just playing careless. Got to clean that up moving forward. Jim Maiello. Yeah, but we just talked to Naheem, who was pretty adamant. He doesn't want to know anything about any of the other scenarios going on uh, before your game or, or during your game. Just curious what, what, what you think. Do you want to know what your fate is, or I mean, what your potential fate is before the game starts, or how do you feel about that whole thing? No, my my all my focus and our team's focus is on beating Jacksonville. Nothing else can happen unless we win this game. So, got to win the game. Mike Chapel. I realize there's a monster game still to play, but when you look back at at Hot Rod's rookie season and what you saw in, in the abbreviated training camp and, and what he's done, is it fair to say he's exceeded expectations or is it, or did you really see this in him? I liked Rod when he was in, in college, you know, just being a spectator, not really even evaluating his, his, his film. I think he's done a very good job. He's been very professional. He works very, very hard. Uh, he's consistent. He hits a clean ball. There's not a lot of variation in his mechanics. And he's really done a good job with that and improving day in and day out. I would say, you know, with any rookie, I'd say that he's definitely, you know, I would think that, you know, he was he has exceeded anybody's expectations because for a rookie to hit that high of a percentage in their first year is is pretty is pretty uh, you know, it's a testament to him for his hard work and what he's done. Thank you. Zach Kiefer. Hey, Bubba, um, things move so fast. I We haven't stopped to take, uh, how's Rigo doing? Is he like back to normal? I mean, is he, have you noticed any difference in his play um, from your expert opinion? It, it just kind of seemed like it, it all happened so fast and he was just back, but um, how's he been the last couple of weeks since he's been back? Rigo's good. He's healthy. He feels good. He communicates with us daily on, you know, how his body feels and you know, when we need to pull back or whatnot, he hasn't had any limitations to this point since he's been back. Um, he's going to continue to improve like all the other players are, and we need him to have a good game this week.